When Algo Expert first entered the scene, I was ecstatic. I mean, it wasn't like the concept was entirely new, what with leak code and hacker rank fighting for global domination, but the execution of it was just so on point. The layout was clean, the in-depth video explanations were great, the programming language options were diverse, the interactive editors had all those smart customizations. It was awesome and I couldn't say enough wonderful things about it. But a lot has changed since then, and you may have noticed I haven't mentioned Algo Expert in quite some time. So do I still recommend Algo Expert? We're jumping back into this very popular Fang interview prep tool and exploring whether it's worth your time and money coming up. Hey, Archie C here. Listen, don't forget to get on our official mailing list. We have the free stuff, like free stuff. We have a free ebook for you. We have so many coding tips, real world insights, and so much more. Link popping up. It's also in the description box of this video. Editor key maps for Vim, for God's sake. They really had all their bases covered right from the beginning. I'm not gonna go through all the features and layout here. I actually covered quite a bit of it in my original video. If you wanna check that out, it's popping up on your screen. I also have a huge overview on my blog, realtoughkenny.com. But since its debut, one thing in particular has changed with Elgo Expert, and that's the questions count. So dramatic, right? Nothing too crazy, but when I first reviewed the platform, it had 90 questions. Now they have 160. There are also a few tweaks to the coding editor, but nothing too outrageous. For example, I think this data structure visualizer is new compared to when I first used the platform. Kind of reminds me of some of the Fang interview prep stuff that Educative does. Their illustration game on Educative is on point. And actually this randomizer is oddly satisfying. I can't stop pressing the randomizer. Stop, stop. Stop. One thing I think that has put a bit of pressure on a platform like this is the fact that Fang interview prep materials are hella popular, so they can be hella profitable. People who are inspired to work at Google as a software engineer, they're gonna spend that extra bit of money to get prepared. And tech entrepreneurs see this market, which is why we have competitor platforms continue to pop up like Algo Monster. Now, Algo Monster hit this scene a little bit after Algo Expert did, and we also have a ton of video-based courses that cover similar concepts Concepts. For example, Steven Greider has one, Cold Steel has one, ZTM has one, pick your flavor. And of course, there's super popular sites like Lead Code. With a site like Lead Code, though, there are so many coding challenges. Literally, it's like thousands of problems. And that's the reason you hear so many engineers saying things like, yeah, man, just grinding away on Lead Code, just, just slowly dying. Leak code is a grind because you can never get through it. And it's more of a collection of challenges, this massive collection, rather than a finite list of hand-picked challenges. And I think that's a big factor in what gives Algo Expert an advantage over something like Leak Code, Hacker Rank, and similar sites. The questions on Algo Expert have always been finite. They've always been focused, and they've always been curated by somebody who has worked at both Facebook and Google and faced some of these exact questions when he went in for his interviews. I do do think a lot of the hype over fangs, I guess they're called mangs now, has died down a bit. Some of it's died down, especially now with the layoffs that sector of the job market is seeing. So I do think a product like this is going through a cool down phase, but regardless of the job market, I think Algo Expert is still a really solid platform. It does have the most feature rich coding environment I've seen. Plus it's very customizable, pretty decent programming, language selection, and the optional video explanations are a nice touch for people who need that walkthrough experience. So do I still recommend Algo Expert? Yes, but for the sole purpose of preparing for a technical interview. I need to emphasize this because sometimes new and aspiring developers get this idea in their head that using a tool like this is going to help them become a better coder. It's not. You do not need to know how to rotate a 2D matrix 90 degrees counterclockwise on a daily basis at your front end web developer job. Don't do it. However, it will teach you problem solving techniques for passing technical interviews, specifically FANG level technical interviews that focus on data structures and algorithms. <laughs>